everyone and welcome back to another video. Today we're talking about our Snapmaker A350. My dad wanted to 3D print this battery holder to hold the double A's and the triple A's that he has lying around the house. And at one point there's these two vertical walls and this perfectly flat horizontal ceiling that the Snapmaker has to go across and build. And I thought that when it went across it was going to go across and kind of dip down and kind of you know, not make it to the other side and fail the print. However, take a look at this footage, it might just prove me wrong. It's going us. It just goes, dude. Look at that. Wow. Oh my god, it's like perfectly. Yeah. Okay, so as you can see in the footage, uh, I was completely shocked. I didn't think it was going to make it, but it did. It went straight across, perfectly flat, horizontal, and it finished the print with no problems at all. It was super awesome. Um, so if you're at home designing 3D printed parts on your stamp maker and you keep adding in you know, all these curves or something like that, and these arches to, you know, in case you're worried that your stamp maker isn't going to be able to print across like a big gap, well now you know it's about the size of a double A, so it's about like a, what, an inch and a half, two inches, and it just goes right across, it's perfect, and it was just fantastic, it blew my mind. So I hope you guys learned something new today, enjoy using your snap maker, I enjoy using mine, and uh, if you enjoyed the video hit like, if you want to see more hit subscribe, and uh, leave a comment down below in the comment section and we can have a chat. Other than that, have a fantastic day. It is snowing outside. I'll see you guys next time.